Most people know the N3 as a leisure corridor and they know especially um, at the end of the year or during peak traffic periods, people who make their way from Johannesburg down to the coast. But of course the N3 is far more than that. And extremely importantly, it's the most important economic corridor in the whole country. There are approximately 5,000, in excess of 5,000 trucks per day making their way along the N3. And of course, behind each and every one of those trucks is a driver. Those drivers work long hours, they very often fatigued, and so there are extreme wellness issues associated with many of those drivers. And we realized this when there were many inexplicable crashes which happened. Single vehicle crashes for no apparent reason, for instance, in a straight stretch of road in good weather conditions. We basically manage the truck stops and the clinics in the truck stops in South Africa. We've currently got 22 wellness centers all over the country where we look after the sexually transmitted infections, HIV, STIs, as well as primary health care for the drivers out on all the national routes. And I just realized that our truck drivers are actually more than just truck drivers, they're asset managers, and that these guys cannot access healthcare services during the day when they're on the national routes. So, so where can they access healthcare services if you don't bring it to them? And with the grateful um, way the guys are always treating us and the thanks we get from them, I realize that there is such a big need in our industry that we need to look after these asset managers and not just truck drivers. Here on entry, we got, we, we got uh, five clinics, that is uh, Villas, this one. We got Warden. We got Harry Smith, we got uh, Tugela, we got Moy River. Last year, roughly, we saw run up at plus minus 10,000 uh, patients that, that came for primary health care, the chronics, the HIV testings, and, and including communities, not only truck drivers, it was communities and the truck drivers. So it's a wonderful opportunity for those drivers just simply to have this facility which is free for them to come along and to, to have their wellness screened. N3TC's involvement was in the establishment or assisting in the establishment of two of the clinics at the truck stops that we are at at the moment and also another one in Warden and also to assist with the ongoing operational costs. And we'll do everything in our power to assist drivers with their health in order to ensure that as they drive behind the wheel, they are at the best possible um, means to, to drive safely from one point to another on their journeys. But very importantly also, it's a means of N3TC saying this is yet another factor in the road safety equation that we take extremely seriously. This year has not been a good year for N3, uh, the N3 toll route in terms of, of crashes and fatalities, unfortunately. And as we approach the festive season, especially now, our message to all our drivers out there, and in particular we would single out the truck drivers for whom we have great admiration working under difficult circumstances, is that let's all join hands together at this time in order to form one team with one goal, and that is to save lives.